everyone, this is Bobo from the Mari server. I'm here to do a video on Royal Alchemist. Now, Royal Alchemist is a very special thing on Mabinogi. It is a, um, a, a thing, I guess you can say, a, kind of like a title that only a certain amount of people within the server can obtain. Uh, let's get right down to it. I believe it is only up to, quote unquote, 100 applicants. Um, the top 100 applicants in the server itself can only be at Royal Alchemist per week. Anyways, um, if you have successfully been a Royal Alchemist, you should be getting a, a little mailbox notification from Sinad in the mail, like this. And he'll be saying, or she'll, It is my pleasure to announce that Bobo has been appointed as a Royal Alchemist. Come see me at Tara Royal Castle. Sinad. I really don't know why they even mention uh, come see me because there's no reason to see um uh, see that person but let's go ahead and do that anyways uh to apply for royal alchemist you simply need to do the following you need to apply which is in tara so i'm going to take a shortcut here i'm going to jump to my uh guild hall so i'm inside uh tara's uh, little castle thingy and for those that don't know this place, to get into this place and exit out here, you need to go to Taro. And it is at Taro's castle, which is going to take a bajillion years to load. Hello. And then it's going to take a bajillion years to load back in. Okay. So right now I am in front of Wrath Royal Castle in Taro. I'm going back in. <laughs> and from here, you just go this way to the second floor. Just go all the way to the second floor. And you'll be able to go to the person to request application. Now, I unfortunately cannot request an application because I've already been appointed as a real alchemist. But I'm just going to show you guys how to get there. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I believe it is the reception room, yes. There you are, Sinad. I keep mistaking you for a guy. Okay. So, you go to this person, and then when you talk to this person, this person's gonna be like, Cook a real alchemist. They're gonna be like, uh, what do you want? And then you say, uh, I wanna be a real alchemist. And they're like, alright, your application has been sent. And voila, you just wait. Um, now how do you actually get it? It's really, uh, it's kind of, it's kind of difficult, actually. Why is my sounds funny? Okay. To become a royal alchemist, you obviously need to have a lot of high, uh, alchemy, uh, ranks. Um, how high? Honestly, I cannot tell you specifically how high. I have, at some point, I have been rank 1 in all my alchemy skills, and yet I still did not get RA for some reason. So, there's a lot of, actually, a lot, a lot, a lot of pro, pro alchemists, too. Pro alchemist, I like to, I like that word. Pro alchemist uh players in Mabinogi, so even getting rank one is not enough. So how do you surpass rank one in all alchemy skills? Um, well there is also the consideration that to become a royal alchemist you need to have a decent amount of uh, journal points, which is where my journal points. Where are my journal points? Right here, under additional info in character. Voila. And this is your journal. Some people don't know about this. Uh, to to access your journal, just go to character and then additional info, journal. And then this thing will pop up. Think of these as like a huge list of little achievements, which you basically obtain. And then your little percentage right here starts to go up, up, up. Um, basically things like reaching a certain level, cum cumulative level, uh, Finishing certain dungeons, um, finishing certain uh, exploration stuffs. I can't really say. I'm not, I'm not gonna go into depth about completing this journal because it's gonna take a long, 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 long time just to finish this. Um, and doing a generation quest, um, 
and also um, just a bunch of other random things, you know, being a pet owner and all that stuff. So having a high amount of adrenal points also will affect your chances of getting a royal alchemy, but mostly it's going to be focused on your alchemy skills, mostly. It's going to be focusing on your alchemy rank skills. I believe also the fact that if you master your skill, it helps it boost even more. So you basically got to be like super, super beefy in alchemy. And uh, that's how you can increase your chances of becoming a royal alchemist. Um, your gears itself, like having high alchemy enchants and stuff like that, is not going to affect it because they're not going to know, like, you know, they're not going to be like, oh, look at you, you've got pro gears. They're not going to know that. It's basically just your alchemy rank and your journal points. So hopefully that is helpful for you guys trying to apply for Royal Alchemy. Another thing is um, once you do become a Royal Alchemist, you must maintain it. Maintain it. Which means you must complete at least uh, a total, a minimum, sorry, a minimum of uh, 60 Alchemy activity points. Now to do that, you just have to either do a few of the uh, following. I'm just going to really list them down. <clears throat> in order to get points for uh, your uh, activity points, you need to be either logged in, and basically, I believe you get one point, hmm, let's see, do, 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 do. Uh, one point an hour, I don't know about that, oh, here it is, achieving points, haha. <laughs> Okay, you get, uh, every hour you're playing, quote-unquote playing, it's more like AFKing, uh, every point is, uh, one hour. You can only get a maximum of, uh, 24 points per day. You can also get points for doing shadow missions or theater missions, which is a maximum of 10 per day. You can also, uh, clear mainstream missions. And this is the awesome thing about Royal Alchemy, and I think this is like the main reason why lots and lots and lots of people want to be a Royal Alchemist, is that a Royal Alchemist is a special person that can go into uh, certain uh, generation missions with people. Uh, like, specially can go in there. Other players that are not Royal Alchemists will not be able to uh, help them by going into that mission. So let's say you're doing a certain generation mission, that uh, you must solo, and uh, if you want to get help, you can't unless you have a Royal Alchemist. So that is basically the um, benefits of becoming a Royal Alchemist. You can help others uh, do finish their mainstream quest. Now this is not for all mainstream quests, of course. There is only specific mainstream quest, and uh, so on. Another awesome thing uh, benefit of becoming a royal, <laughs> sorry, becoming a royal alchemist is the awesome pose, and I think like 99% of the uh, people who apply for this uh, position just want the pose. <laughs> so this is the pose. Basically, you you uh, must equip your cylinder um, to pose once you have this royal alchemy pose, and you kind of like you know have your hands on your hips and. All that stuff. This is specifically only for the female pose. The male pose is more like they're crossing their arms like, you know, on the balls kind of a uh, pose. So that is another benefit of becoming a royal alchemist is just you get a special pose that no one else can have. Of course, it's only when you're holding uh, a cylinder. Another awesome uh, benefit is the title. And I'm going to go ahead and type it down. You can only use this title if you are a royal alchemist. If you have been a royal alchemist and you lost it, you can't equip this title. You actually have to currently be a royal alchemist just to, uh, you know, keep it. So this is the real alchemist title. Oops, I closed it. Turn it. Royal alchemist, there you go. Ahem, <clears throat> so for the royal alchemist title, you get quite a bit of, uh, boofs. And that, that is a uh, crystal making success plus one, synthesis success plus one, fragmentation success plus one, water alchemy damage plus 15, and fire alchemy damage plus five. 
it is a decent title for uh I honestly would say it's a decent title for beginners um alchemy but there are a lot more better alchemy titles out there um but that is uh one awesome extra bonus for being a royal alchemist another awesome extra bonus for being a royal alchemist is having the special uniform that only royal alchemists can wear um this is the obtainable from Sinad right here and um i believe i forgot honestly if you can get it for free or not i think i think you have to pay hold on let me double check that i think the outfit itself is free when you first get it da, da, da. okay once you have become a royal alchemist you will see that receive the title automatically Blah blah blah. You must speak to Sinat to receive the Royal Alchemist robe and boots. It's not man mandatory to obtain the uniform. However, I suggest to get it if you're if you're going to proceed with alchemy as one of your main skills. Suggested, so, of course. Okay, so I'm guessing it is free. I don't remember. I'm guessing it is free at first. But if you ever destroy it, lose it, drop it, or whatever. You actually have to pay Sinad um, some gold just to get another one. You can't have more than one, of course. You can only ha uh, currently hold one. Okay, so anyways, this outfit is going to come with pre-enchants. It's going to come with a soggy academic enchant. Um, and it's also going to come, for the boots, it's going to come with a baking flooded. Ignore the fact that my boots currently has Vicious on it because I overrided the baking... Uh, enchant with vicious just to like have my own little personalized um minus cp shoes i mean that's a, that's an awesome uh thing about having these boots is that you can do that if you wanted to so uh that is uh the awesome thing about the uh the outfit these enchants are actually pretty decent you cannot really enchant burn them i mean you could but there's no point because these can only go on Royal Alchemist outfit. So, no point in burning them, right? Um, and also, I believe some of these enchants, or more, all of them, I don't remember. Yep, it seems like all of them. You need to be actually equipping the Royal Alchemist title just to activate the enchant. So, just keep that in mind. Uh, I've had a question about like whether the Royal Alchemist uh, enchants were better than others. And I personally would like to say that there are better titles out there, better enchants out there. Um, but if you don't have any, uh, this is a good start. So this is basically the Royal Alchemist outfit and the pose. There's the full set right there. Now, here's the difficult part. Uh, the difficult part is really just maintaining it. You are going to be literally competing to be the highest alchemist uh top 100 alchemist applicants in the entire server so in order to maintain it you're gonna have to keep beefing yourself up um, which means once you have surpassed rank 1 in all your alchemy skills you have gotta do journal points and a whole bunch of other stuff master them titles so that is uh, basically uh, how you can maintain your royal alchemist but most of the time, it's just maintaining the points, because once you lose the points, once you've, like, let's say, one week, you've only maintained up to 50, uh, 57, <laughs> 57 points, you're going to immediately lose that uh, Royal uh, Alchemist uh, um, status. So be sure, be sure, be sure to maintain that status. Let's see, let's see, let's see. And also, let's see, I forgot to mention this. Also, you can get a quest from Sinad. Hello, Sinad. Please give me a quest. Royal Alchemist. Okay. So you can either request a new uniform, checkpoints. I'm going to click on checkpoints. You can be like, oh, yo, Bobo, you just got became a Royal Alchemist. You only have one point. So, ah! I need to get 60 more points. So, I mean, 59. <laughs> so that is uh, what I need to maintain for the rest of the entire week. If I do not maintain it, by Friday, Saturday uh, morning, it's gonna they're gonna appoint new alchemist. Uh, I can do a check mission, and he's she is gonna give me a new mission. And that also, I gotta go outside though just to get the quest because you know owls apparently don't fly indoors. Uh, give the quest. And yes, 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 I did forget the most important part of Royal Alchemist 
is the dates. The dates are uh, every midnight, uh, every Friday at midnight, they're going to announce the uh, new Royal Alchemist. Um, so you do need to apply before Friday to uh, become a Royal Alchemist. That is uh, one thing, important thing to keep in mind. Okay, so I got the quest. I should got the quest. Where is it? Where is the quest? So it is. It's going to be Royal Alchemist quest. And it's going to say something like, it's, it's just really a random quest. It's going to tell me to do something like defeat. Right here it says, defeat seven python shamans. And if I do that, I will be rewarded eight points. Now I can't spam this quest, of course. You know, that'd be too cheap. You know, just to get points. I can only get one of these uh, quests a day. But I can literally just do missions like uh, martial arts or shadow missions and stuff like that. Or just even AFK. Like, literally, I can just stand around doing nothing. And I will get points just to maintain for the rest of the week. So that is basically Royal Alchemist maintaining points, 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 points. Um, I hope this little video here was helpful for you guys. Um, please know that you actually do lose points if you don't log in for about 48 hours, I believe. Uh, you lose like one point every two hours. So even if you, let's say, you've maintained up to 60 points for the first half of the week, and then you start to like get lazy and not log in for two days, you are going to lose those points. So do keep in mind about that. And that is it. That is basically all the uh, information about Royal Alchemist. If I have missed anything, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. Because, you know, sometimes I do miss things. Um, and I hope you guys found this video helpful. Not discouraging. Because I know it, it becomes really discouraging when people apply for a Royal Alchemist. And then on uh, Saturday morning, it says, Sorry, you have not been appointed as Royal Alchemist. That is a real big bummer. I've had those many times. So just 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 know don't give up give up. Keep pushing it. You will get it. Alright? Alright. Anyways, once again, thanks for watching and stay awesome.